Okay, hello. This is my um, unboxing of my TronSmart MK908 Android Mini PC. So uh, we got this from uh, geekbine.com uh, in August of 2013. It took about two weeks for it to get here. And um, it looks like it came directly from China. Um, and uh, we want to thank uh, Jim Collison at The Average Guy TV as he uh, sponsored this review. And uh, I'm going to be doing some blogs on his site at TheAverageGuy.tv. So um, check that out. Here goes the unboxing here. So there's the box. It's a, it's actually like a, uh, pretty much like a retail box for a device would be. I didn't know if it would just be kind of all plain there, but it actually has some packaging. And there you go. So it's a quad core A9 processor. It gives you some description of the ports on the back there and such. And we have a hello thing there. So take that apart, and something's in this. Take that apart. Looks like we just have user manual there, and this pulls it apart here. So we pull that out. That's the there's the actual unit. It's got. Some ventilation there on the back as well. So we have our typical USB ports, micro SD card slot, just pretty much exactly what we were expecting based on looking on it online. So there's that. What else does it come with here? Accessories. There are different cables there. This guy is our charging brick. This is the uh, high definition. It looks like that's a mini HDMI to regular HDMI. Um, so this isn't one of the units where you can plug it directly into the TV. You're going to have to go through a cable. And this is our adapter. I think this lets you plug an extra USB in like this. I'm going to have to test that. That's not something I'm confirmed about, but... I think that's what you can do with that. And then I believe this guy is our power cable. Or actually, maybe that's the power and that one's the extra for that. That might be for connecting it to a computer, actually. I think that's what that's for. And... So, yep, once I get it up and running, I'll have this guy, these plugged in here for power, and then this guy will plug in here for the TV. I think I only need this one if I'm plugging in the computer, but we'll find out in the full reviews. So, let's get this thing plugged in. I'm going to do that in a separate video, but thanks for watching this. Uh, again, thanks to Jim Collison over at the Average Guy dot tv and he runs the uh, home tech podcast and um got us set up with this so we're going to give it the the full review and we the main goal is we want to see if we can use it for kind of a desktop replacement and some education uses for running a web browser and a word processor so we're going to see what an android mini pc can come up with thanks for watching